glad that we were able to hustle and get both of them out before the end of the year. To have my nails done by you would be everything. Oh, that's so sweet. So I'm super glad that we were able to launch both of them before the end of the year, both Miss Magic Syrup and Miss Bon Bon. Let me know in the comments which bottle you think is prettier. They're both so special to me. And Magic Syrup, to be honest with you guys, the bottle, we went back and forth, back and forth for a good few months because I could not get the design how I wanted it in my mind, but I'm really happy with the gold stamping and the ombre effect and then of course the white details on the cap and then Miss Bon Bon is of course also very anime-esque inspired both of them are really beautiful so I already have peel off base coat on my nails I'm going to use fantasy pink DIY gel to apply them But I'm just going to follow the cuticle area, just a hair, to make sure that it fits really nicely. And then I'm going to square them out prior because these nails are so long, it feels a little awkward if you file them while they're on. Trying to hold them. If you're doing it on someone else, it's easier, but if you're doing it on yourself, it feels a little funny. Funny daddy. Using fantastic file and 100. Oh, I also have some new stuff coming up for Christmas. Some more limited edition stuff coming up for Christmas, being um, some acrylics which were actually inspired by one of our BAs. She gave me the idea, which was Miss Enchanted Valley. Shout out to her. And also a big shout out to Baby Girl Nails. I have not replied to her. I feel terrible, but literally I feel terrible for not replying to her. And I also feel terrible like physically. I know her grand baby is about to be here any day too. Are you guys ready for Thanksgiving? I can't believe it's like already here. It doesn't even feel like the season yet. Especially because it's so hot. Like I'm wearing a sweater and I'm like, why am I wearing a sweater? It's too hot. Take my pink toothpick. I'm gonna remove any excess that might have ran. Oh, great. Oh, no, that she just seems. And again, I apologize, you guys, if I can't get to every single comment during the snatching of the Philanders.
at that length, though, she is no joke, you guys. She is just stunning. And the squeeze roll two key is such a game changer. Do you want to say hi to anybody, Melissa? Say hi to your mom. Maybe she's watching. Is she watching? Has she ever seen one of my videos? Have you? Really? Have you? You've never seen one of my videos? Really? Why not? You don't know my Instagram? And she works here, you guys. Yes. No, don't watch me. That's embarrassing. You know, just a really short length. This is like a very like coup d'etat. You know, you just want something really simple, really discreet, very school teacher friendly, Sunday school teacher, first lady of the church, somebody that doesn't like fake nails. Like when someone says, oh, I don't like fake nails, I, I like real, I like organic nails, I like natural nails. This is the kind of length she wears, I think. See, look at that length. It's like so simple, so discreet, very, very like demure. There you go. That's Miss 5XL Coffin. You know, just a little chapstick kind of nail. So let's bake her for one minute. Oh, and I was going to show you guys how fast the um, thing that you can dry. That's the drill bit holder. Yes. Let me get a display tip. So, very soccer mom, very, very. Here is one of our new clear stiletto display tips. Oh, I got badges already. Thank you guys. Oh my gosh, I am so wrapped up in the fantasy. I have not even been able to see who sent me badges, so thank you. Ooh, it sounds like we're in a nightclub in Tokyo in 1985. So these colors are buildable, okay? Oh, this length, she is just so unnoticeable, undetectable, very, very nonchalant, untraceable foundation, uh, same for your nails, can't even tell. Aloha! So I'm going to use Magic Syrup 125, just going to do a little coat. And we're going to bake her inside the Barbie Dunning Lamp for one minute. I'm gonna get my fantastic file. I'm gonna start shaping the sidewalls of these nails while she's baking. To give her that nice boxy side that the girls love.
This is very, very sport length, I think. Very active. Ugh, I cut myself here with like, I think opening up some Pedialyte and ugh, I can't get over it. girl that, you know, she wasn't sure if she was gel or not. Here you go, honey. Your prayers have been answered. So now we're going to take our famous mini toy nail drill with, I'm going to use a power top bit and I'm going to blend in the cuticle. to you guys is that we have some major changes coming to the website well it's not like super major but I think it's gonna make a huge difference especially to those that complain a lot about the website that they can't read anything that the font this or that it's like okay girl Ugh, such a party pooper but whatever so there's gonna be one well no two major changes to the website that I think are gonna make it look or feel new but rest assured it's not going to change the essence of what enochtour.com is or what it's going to look like much but it will give it you know a little facelift one of them is going to be a new category so that way you can find all of our new products in one section and the other one let's see if anybody can guess It's not going to be a new website or anything like that. That's great, Max. I'll buy whatever it looks like, but I'm still... But it's still growth, yes. Leave it pink or else. New pics? No, not new pictures. makeup no not yet I'm taking the Twiggy file just making sure those sides are really razor sharp and straight
new font. Yes, it is a new font. The whole website is getting a new font. And it will all be the same font, actually. When are the 10XL? 10XL is probably not coming out until either the end of December or January 2022. And the maximum square, I can't tell you, but maybe next week. You guys know the new Resident Evil movies coming out this um, month? I'm so excited because Nicole Rodriguez is in it. I'm gonna go in with the diamond prep bit actually and just really refine the vertical area a little bit more. bit of gel right there that she's giving me anxiety. Simple. So let's get some of our new stickers. Let's use some of the 3D ones because they are beautiful. And I've been so busy I haven't even put them inside my, my box. My, my sticker book. Or maybe we can do some of the glitter stickers. Those are really pretty.
the base of a new shiny star in Europe. There she is, I see her again. And remember you guys, the Chinese star, glitter top coats add to the design. They don't take away because they are very, very soft. <coughs> and Uranus has this really, really soft pearlized glitter. And I'm gonna bake her for 30 seconds inside the dining. Barbie darling now. So I'm feeling this purple one, this black one. What's that? You know what? I'm really feeling this black one. This one? The green one's really pretty too. Should I do the green one? Instead of the black? I need to both. That's too much. No. It's never and, too it much an axe video. and it doesn't really go together. It, Maybe these two. Those are so cute. Are they like flashy? No, they have glitter in them though. They're so cute. This is very, very like fairy esque. Yeah, like Tinkerbell. It's giving me um, Tinkerbell vibes. Tomorrow Labyrinth. Half a day to all of our tomorrow viewers from the micro island nation of Guam. Look at that. That's how you know a sticker is good quality when she's hard to peel off. Mm -hmm. 